Hello, this is Elio Grifanov, the developer of HSM Advisor Speed and Fit Calculator. Today I would like to show you the new feature in HSM Advisor, it's called uh, Tool Inventory Control. It is um, a new feature in already existing tool database functionality. Mm, it helps you keep track of stock, it helps you create uh, purchase requests, and it helps you restock the, the tools into your database. Now, to begin working with it, you need to add the tool to a purchase request. There are several ways of doing that. You can do it through the Edit Tool Information, just by clicking on Add Tool to Request, and enter the number of tools you're, uh, you need to buy for this maybe a particular job, or maybe you're short on them. Or you can specify the minimum stock volume, and when the stock number drops below minimum, it will it will show you the warning. So when HSM Advisor sees there are any tools that need to be ordered, it creates um, a red flag alert. When you hover over it with the mouse, it shows the, the short list of the tools that need to be ordered. When you click on the red flag, it opens the Add Tools to Request form. On this one, you have to enter the number of tools you're ordering, if this number is not already here. And uh, once you're satisfied with that, you can click Create Purchase Request Form. On this form, you specify the, the company information, the handling information, maybe your phone number, contact information, and you have to customize this table over here to show the information you need for the purchasing. That may be supplier name, supplier part number, or um, maybe price or number of tools to request. By the way, you can edit any of these tools right from this, uh, from this uh, table. Just like that. Once you set everything up, you click on Export Purchase Request, and it launches your default browser, and it shows that information in the easy to print form. This one you can save as a HTML file, you can send it via email, or you can print it out right from here. Once you've printed out your purchase request, uh, sheet, click on Save Request button. And uh, that's it. Now you can close the window. When there are any tools that are waiting on the order, it shows them as a yellow flag. When you hover over it with the mouse, it shows the tool uh, on order. When you click on it, it shows the tools on request form. And when you receive any of the tools you've ordered previously, enter the number you have received. And you don't even need to apply receive to stock yet. You can just update them as you go. Because it, it remembers this value between the even the program latches. It's, it remembers them. And once you have entered the tools the number of tools you received, and you can uh, apply received to stock. That's it. What it does, it adds the received. Uh, it it transfers the number. Um, it subtracts the received value from on request, and it adds it to the to the in stock. Just like that. And basically that's all. Thank you for watching. Bye.